here in Fox Chapel, there are actually two petitions circulating. One asking for a mask mandate, the other asking for choice. But Fox Chapel officials have decided that they will put a plan in place that recommends masks for students, but doesn't require them. However, here at Fox Chapel High School in about an hour, parents are expected to pack a board meeting to have their say. So for us, we're not we're not nervous anymore. We want our kids back in schools. We want them to be as normal as they can possibly be. The Fox Chapel parents I spoke with. Is it so important to avoid that minor inconvenience of wearing a mask versus the risks to them, to their families? Each say their message on masks in class isn't about taking a side, but a stance. For Kim Bowles, masks are a must for her incoming kindergartner Sam and third grader Tim who won't be back unless everyone is masked. If it's not safe, I can't go back. Tim's mom says she will present a packet and experts when she asks the Fox Chapel School Board to change their plan. Just looking for a choice. Mandy Seidel says she will be at the meeting too to encourage the district to keep their plan for voluntary masking in place. Our stance is really mass choice. You know, we just want these kids to have a voice. They've been voiceless for almost two years now, so we just want to give them the option, you know, to be comfortable in the schools. We're not asking you to, you know, go to school in a hazmat suit. It's a mask on your face. The strong messages from both sides, comments and discussion begins inside Fox Chapel High School at 7 o'clock. That meeting to discuss the plan will also be live streamed. We have a link for you at WTAE.com. Board officials say they will vote on their plan on August 9th. In Fox Chapel, Marcy Cipriani, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.